What's going on guys? It's your boy Gold Sniper 9 back with some more Star Wars Jedi Survivor for all you lovely people out there. Alright, we're back on our moon again. I believe we are supposed to be heading towards the Mantis. So we, that is what we are going to do. We're going to fast travel over there and I'll be right back. Alrighty boys, so we've arrived at the Mantis. Let's find out where we need to go. Blaster, better run a little faster. Go by a little saloon. The location, shattered moon. Hey, look at that. He ain't dead. How you doing, kid? How? Whatever you did up there, sure kicked the firebug nest. Ravis is gone. Yeah, that'll do it. So let me guess. Back to Kobo? Yeah, I think so. Say, uh, jetpack. Give me a hand up here. Yeah. You're brooding. Again. That easy to read my mind? It's no Jedi trick. I just pay attention. <laughs> On the Shattered Moon, I saw Dagon confront Centauri. He was so consumed by Tantalor that he completely lost his way. Reminds me of my fight with the Empire these last few years. Let's just say I don't want to end up like him. You are very stubborn, but ambition does not drive you. I don't understand why she didn't see the change in him before it was too late. They dreamed together. And suffered together. A shared dream is not so easy to wake from. Is that what troubles you? Losing yourself. If you ever stray from your path, we will guide you back. just gotta love those textures when you load into every new planet on this game it's always fun alrighty boys so it looks like we have to confront Dagon so let's find ourselves a nice little teleportation or fast travel point and we can go uh we can go see Dagon hopefully he's willing to sit down have a nice little cup of coffee and we can just talk this all out and you know it'll be one big huge misunderstanding you know you know he'll turn back he won't be a Sith anymore He'll just come back to the order. He'll help me restore it. The Jedi will become one. I know, I know. Come on now. It'll be okay. <sighs> What's your name, lad? If I'm to hold a grudge, best to know the name. I'm Cal. This is BD-1. My bottom old mum dubbed me Scuba Stev. Scuba the Fisher, am I? You know, there's a fish tank down in Pylon Saloon that could use some attention. Pylon Saloon? That'll ever infest in watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. Get I asked. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. Meet me at the saloon and we'll appraise this so-called tank. <laughs> All 
Alrighty, boy. So, so it looks like we were looking for Dagon here. I think we're on the right path. Let's see what's up ahead, buddy. Where are you going, little chicken? You chicken bird, or whatever the hell you are. Oh, there's enemies over there, and a meditation point here. Forces with me. It seemed like you knew what to do there, Trooper. Let's just continue on our way. Stormtrooper wasn't working out for you. Ooh, forgot about those things here. Those things got stronger since the last time we've seen them. Hello, boys. Didn't mean to. Ooh, we're not signing up for that. That's a little too much. We're going to continue on our way. We're going to grab this. Thank you very much. We weren't ready for that fight, so we just, uh, we had to keep going. This could get pretty ugly, BD. Visibility is pretty bad. Gotta push through. Oh, those things are not good at all. Okay. Nope. Okay. Nope. <clears throat> Alright, let's just meditate here for a second. Let's go. It's way too dark and way too foggy. I definitely feel like something's gonna... What the hell? Okay. Yeah, buddy, that's what you get. I definitely saw you in the background, but... Oof, okay. Here. 
There we go, pal. Something was off. Mm. Oh. Hello, buddy. Didn't mean to let you out. Toss me one, BD. Okay, that takes care of him, I guess. Well. Let's see what was hiding in his cave. Run, Shanna! We gotta go! Oof. So it looks like a whole bunch of, uh... We gotta climb the rest of the way. I don't even know what those things are called. Snow Yetis or something? I don't even know. Oh, that's not good at all. Okay. Nope. That would have been really bad if all those things just came and blew up. Alright, boys. I guess this is where we need to go. Take care of them. Well, I'm in for a treat. I think this is our first time we've ran into a purge trooper. Why do I want to enter BD's visor right now? Oh, we almost died. There you go. All three of you. Pretty big force sent to secure a shuttle. Must be something inside. Maybe like a Ravis 2.0 in here or something. Not a good day for these droids. Purge Trooper. Got what was coming to him. What is it? Oh. You want it? All yours, bud. BD, what do you just do, buddy? Some kind of electro dart? <laughs> Next time, maybe run a scan before you start firing. <laughs> oh, okay, so. Let's adjust our aim. <laughs> Nice, okay. So BD can do some pretty cool tricks now. Oh, 
Hit it. Ah, uh, okay. They want us to run off this wall here. Dash over here. And there we go. Well, that's definitely going to come in handy and be a lot very useful. Maybe we should head back up where we were just at. So close, nice, okay. So now that we got that, what we can do, use this. Change the angle. There we go. And now we'll be able to run against this. Perfect. Nope. They thought they had a chance against me right there, but they really didn't. I have a little vendetta against these little small things. Because they have those portion, or those little, uh... I forget what they're called, that you can give the beat, uh, Z. So that's kind of like the main reason why I go for them all the time. Something's up there. I think Dagon's building himself a new arm or something like that. He doesn't have Ravis as his left arm anymore. Dial in the shot. Launch it. Nice of you guys to finally load in, I guess. Okay. Might want to work on your footwork, though, buddy. You're not operational. You don't look too operational for me. Sorry. Nice. All right. Something tells me. That's a lot of firepower. Yeah, that's a that is a lot of firepower. So let's definitely get this meditation point real quick. Be right back, boys. All right. Let's continue. I know some of you guys probably wonder why I always, you know, do these cuts after getting a meditation point. It's kind of because I go and get some water or I go and take a bathroom break really quick or something like that. I figured I'd let you guys know. Oof, okay. 
I'll eat that punch any day of the week. Just like that. Yeah, I did kill them all. I see him, BD. Oof, okay, more. To be honest, you guys know you could have brought me some flowers. You guys didn't have to bring me a whole bunch of stormtroopers. But I mean, either way, however you want to go, let's do this. Okay, homie with the RPG needs to be fired because he's taking out his own people and he's hitting me at the same time, but he's not really doing a good job at it. Can't even pull you down here buddy i gotta wait there we go now i can pull you down here and you know what because you want to keep throwing firing rockets at me bye have a good time oh wow i'm not gonna lie all these enemies they're sending at me i feel like i'm in boot camp and man, Jesus, these goddamn snow troopers with flamethrowers need to go. Oof, okay. Uh, let's use that. Can we jump? I, I guess we're stuck. Oh man, who wants the smoke? Who wants the smoke? Because this guy right here, he's getting stabbed. Anybody else out here who wants the smoke? I'm ready. Jedi Cal is all the way fully ready. They keep throwing everything they got. It's all good. Keep sending. Ooh, these things are fun. Did I really make a big mistake though? Because that is the last of them. And even though I do got a sliver of health left, we still made it through BD. Let's hopefully get upstairs and find a meditation point because man oh man, we're not gonna make it past anywhere else. This game is definitely given a challenge. Okay, I was gonna say, are we stuck here for a second? Oh, this doesn't look good. Does not look good at all. should open the door. I... I should... What? There's nothing to see here. Your eyes must be playing tricks on you. There's... nothing to see here. My eyes must be playing tricks on me. Quite so, sir. That's enough. Get back on the comms. Yes, sir. I appreciate you. Minds don't stop them from conquering the galaxy. Okay, boys, I think I got an idea of what we're supposed to do. On you, BD. There we go. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. I was like, how do we get over here to this other side? There's no other, like, pl uh, platform for us to pull down or anything like that. Come on, BD. Do your thing. Well, that was easy. Sorry, Rick, the door technician. Okay. I 
I don't know if this garrison could hold against a raider attack. I know, I know. Who would you want to win? The Rancor or the Gun Dark? Okay, this is high. How in the hell is Dagon Cat all the way up here with one arm? That's my question. Is he just force jumping everywhere? Long way down. We've come so far. That's a very long way down. Jeez. Look at all those clouds. The scenery in this game is beautiful. Shouts out to developers and all their work. Because man oh man, it's very much appreciated. I was definitely going to say, how are we getting across this one? Because I definitely didn't see any platforms or anything. Might as well grab this meditation spot. Okay, let's go. Alrighty, boys. Well, I figured this is a good spot to actually stop on this episode. Oh, is Bode coming in? Is that what I just heard? Oh. Well, looks like we'll be going on with Bode in the next episode. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying the series. I've been enjoying making them. Hopefully this, this video is a little bit shorter. I know the other ones have been a little bit longer. They've been on the 30 minute range. But I'm trying to make this video shorter for you guys. Trying to fit everything I can in. The whole entire story and all that. Hopefully you guys do enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.